Enabling My Carfax in Manage Online can save time and improve accuracy with the My Carfax Quick VIN feature. You can make better service recommendations, drive more revenue, and view service history from multiple shops with the My Carfax Service History Check. And increase customer loyalty through service reminders in the My Carfax app enrollment that directs customers back to your shop. Now, all these benefits are included with Manage Online when you consistently process invoices. So let's demonstrate how to set up My Carfax, how these features work in Manage Online, and how to ensure you're processing invoices so that vehicle history data can be made available whenever you need it. To set up and enable the My Carfax feature, we'll click the Setup tab, we'll select User Options, then My Carfax. If you select Enable My Carfax, the Enable My Carfax Customer Enrollment box is also selected. But you can deselect that option if you like. Then let's fill in the business contact and technical contact information. We'll click Update. And OK. Now using the My Carfax Quick VIN is the easiest and quickest way to retrieve vehicle information. Now if we start from a new vehicle screen here, we'll enter the license plate number and we'll click Quick VIN. We'll verify that the vehicle information is correct, click the line item and select. Now the Carfax service will ask you to confirm the appropriate submodel and we'll click select again. And all the vehicle information is entered here and the VIN is also entered. Let's enroll a customer's vehicle in the My Carfax app. Now this customer is a member with one of her other vehicles, but her Ford F-150 is not enrolled yet, as indicated by the yellow on the My Carfax icon. So we'll select the icon, we'll make sure there is a VIN populated, and once that's done, just click register. And now this new vehicle is associated with this customer, and she'll see service history for the F-150 as well. And we'll show you how to register a new customer in a minute when we invoice a repair order. Now there are three ways that you can view vehicle service history in Manage Online to see what has been reported to Carfax on a vehicle. First, from this new vehicle screen, simply click Service History. Here we have all the reported data for this vehicle. It's arranged in date order from latest to earliest. To see what's been done on a particular date, click the line. That line item will expand. If you want to view them all, you can select the Expand All radio button and scroll through all the records. So we'll click Close to go back to the vehicle page. You can look up vehicle history from the Vehicle Work History in the Report section of Manage Online. So we'll choose Work History Report enter the license plate number, and click display. Now there are two tabs on this page, local, which is all the work that's been done in your shop, and my Carfax. So we'll click the my Carfax tab to view the Carfax data. Finally, let's look at the work screen. With the vehicle tab selected, we'll click history. Again, we have the two tabs, local and my Carfax. Now it's important to note that none of the service history pulled from Carfax is stored in your database. It's merely retrieved each time you search for the work history. And we certainly don't share any sensitive customer information. The only requirement is that you process invoices in Manage Online to ensure the sharing of vehicle service data between Manage Online and Carfax. So let's process an invoice and we'll show you the My Carfax enrollment features and the reports that are available. Now I have a completed repair order here and I'm ready to accept payment. So I'll select invoice here. And on this invoice confirmation screen, I'll confirm the mileage in and out. I'm gonna choose a media code to help me track how my customers are hearing about me. That's a best practice. And I'm gonna select the payment method. Now, if my customer agrees to enroll in the My Carfax app, I'm going to select this My Carfax icon, which is currently red. This brings over the customer email and VIN and by opting in with this selection, the customer is now a member as denoted by the icons change to green. 
and they can now download the app on their phone and your shop becomes the preferred service location. Now the final steps to complete the invoice is to select pay and then email or print the invoice. Okay, finally, one of the main reasons to invoice and manage online other than access to these great My Carfax features is the reports available to you, such as the business analysis report and the profit tracker report. Now this data is only available when you invoice and it's not available from a repair order or an estimate.